All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome in. So we have some breaking Jets news that just came out like two minutes ago here. Uh, this wasn't actually reported by any uh, beat reporters or anything like that. In fact, it was actually the Jets sh uh, social media page that released the news. But it turns out that the Jets are bringing back center Connor McGovern. This is huge. Look, I, I know the NFL draft is later on this week. I know there's so, I mean, at this point, we've heard like a million Aaron Rodgers reports a million Aaron Rodgers rumors, McCall Hardman, Alan Lazard. The Jets have, you know, we, we've been in the headlines a lot, but I'm not going to sit here and lie to you. This news is probably some of my favorite news that I've heard all season regarding the team. I am so happy that the Jets figured out the center position for next year. Okay, before today, we didn't have a center on the roster. We're talking about a Super Bowl championship. We're talking about taking on Aaron Rodgers' big money deal, trading away draft picks, acquiring a guy. He might only play for one year. We don't have a center. We have holes on the offensive line. That has now changed. And we're bringing, and there was so much, you know, there's a lot of talk about Ben Jones, you know, a lot of talk about John Michael Schmitz, uh, Joe, uh, uh, who else? Tittman from, uh, from Wisconsin, potentially as a second round option. Uh, but, you know, in the end, it's Connor McGovern, a guy who knows the team a guy who has uh, chemistry and continuity with this offensive line, playing next to Lakin Tomlinson, playing next to Elijah Vera Tucker. And I know the Jets' offensive line has had their, you know, bit of, it, they've had their issues throughout the years uh, that, that Connor's been here. But uh, I got to say, these past two seasons with McGovern, he, he hasn't been the best. But he definitely, definitely, definitely has not been the worst, right? He's He's been reliable. He plays. He started in all 17 games uh, for the team last year. I'm happy that we have a familiar face back in the locker room. We have a massive, massive position of need figured out. Also, this is it, it, this is kind of a little bit of a side tangent, but another huge, huge benefit here. Now the Jets don't have to enter the draft and you know, enter these Aaron Rodgers uh, trade talks with the with the looming question in their head: What's going on at center? Will Ben Jones sign? Will Connor McGovern sign? Do we have to draft one? No, that's figured out. It's before the draft. So now the Jets don't have to go out and select Tittman. They don't have to go out and select John, uh, John Michael Schmitz. They don't have to go out and maybe reach for somebody else uh, in round four and you know put so much responsibility on that guy uh, to come in and start. No, McGovern is a veteran. He knows the team. Obviously going to be working with new uh, offensive coordinator Hackett here. But at the end of the day, slam dunk move. This is the best news I could have heard, I could have heard today outside of a Rodgers trade. But man, the biggest position of need has been filled. So I'll leave it there. And, and by the way, the financials of the deal, the length of the contract has not been released. I'm assuming it's a one-year deal. I know there was a lot of talk, a lot of speculation um, going into the offseason, or yeah, going into free agency, that there was going to be some money in free agency uh, for McGovern. It doesn't really look like it's panned out that way. So anyway, I I'm totally pumped up. Totally, totally pumped up here. Let me know your thoughts. And as always, go Jets.